Hello everyone, and welcome back to Fablehaim in our beloved governor's ascension through the Jin dynasty. Before I press the end turn button, I um, reappointed her as administrator. I kicked her out of her office and then reappointed her because she wasn't showing up here. So I'm not sure if that's intended or if it, she would eventually come back or whatever. But our benefits are once again here in Wudu. Increase industry, increase income from all sources and increase income from commerce and silk. Sima Wei would like peace, and I'm not against this. I'm a little bit against it. Because we are kind of just carving a path towards his territory. You know what? We'll, we'll deny this. He is the object of our war. He has slain our generals and people and taken our territory. We will not let him escape. We also dragged our allies into a war with Zhang Zhengli, which uh, I don't think she appreciated very much. Sima Yong declared war on Sima Lun. Sima Wei vassalized Sima Lun. Oh, okay. Sima Ong signed a peace treaty with Sima Lun. The Jin Empire declared war on Sima Wei. Hey, hey. The Empress demands that traitors be crushed. It is clear now that many have seen opportunity in the chaos at court, and their own treasonous desires have manifest. The Empress has charged you with being the sword of justice that cuts down these would-be usurpers. Now we are still heading towards wealth and mind, kind of. So let's build our reserves. You will need reserves if war is coming, and so you begin those preparations. At the start of your turn, have a treasury of 4,500 gold. Mission success. The finest armor has arrived. What did we get? Where is... Aha. Uh -huh. The raiments of war. Grill deployment own army. Ah. <gasps> hey, Baijin. Bro, I have a new piece of armor for you. So this is instinct... It is not part of a set, so it's just good armor. Um, you have silver armor. You have gold armor, so you don't need it. What right over here? In Luigi's forces. Fai Yi. I don't remember who has guerrilla deployment. Does anyone? So Sama Ing's retinue has guerrilla deployment, and I think that's it. So we'll give it to Baijin. Just to make this army better than it already is. And with Luji, we will give Fai Yi uh, the armor piece that's coming next turn. Maybe I should have done that the other direction because we're about to assault Chang'an with Luji, but. Oh, well. Oh, I can't reach it this turn? Are you serious? Well, that's fine. <laughs> Everything's fine. Don't worry about it. Take a look at our quick deals. We do have one trade route available. Unfortunately, no one else does. We could get military access with a few people, but I don't think we're in desperate need of anything at the moment. Bashi. What would you like, Bashi? We were increasing this so that we can multiply our silk income. Do we continue doing that? I think so. We're currently in an okay position with food. We could increase the toolmaker. Let's continue down that path, since it's fresh in my mind. And in Shongong, we do have some public order issues, just a little bit. So let's uh, remedy that, shall we? And with Ba, again, I'm still not sure what I'm doing here. Hmm. I could upgrade it. Well, we're not going to upgrade it. But uh, keep that in your minds. We could trade it. We could upgrade it. We could do nothing with it. Uh, no. Why would I become a vassal of you? You are much weaker than I am. It doesn't make any sense at all. Nope. We were actually a deciding vote there. So this would be a valiant defeat. Everyone's coming out. But the important thing here is we're not fighting in the settlements, which was my ultimate goal anyway. 
So this should be interesting, actually. Liang Shi. And of course, there's only one combat general. The other two are strategists. So I think Chi Shang hunts, duels him, beheads him, and then Fa Yi hunts down the strategists. I guess Lu Ji can participate as well. If he feels like it, you know? Maybe he doesn't feel like it. Alright. So let's... I guess we position here in this open field. That's fine. No big deal. I don't want you guys group one, though. We need to finish upgrading this uh, army. So once we take this back, that's what we're going to do. And we'll have to remember to destroy as many people as possible. Because, of course, they're coming out to us. Our cataphracts. Love me, cataphracts. We do have this crappy cavalry. We should probably replace with Cheung marauders eventually. Let us begin. Presumably, they're going to give us plenty of time to position. So... Yeah. Are arriving. They're going back to their enforcement, so I will see you guys in a time skip. The AI is having a very hard time deciding what they want to do. They've been going back and forth non-stop, but I think they have finally decided on their approach. I think. Try not to waste all of our ammunition here. Because we're going to need it. I'm not sure where we should be shooting, though. I guess we'll just let us shoot into the middle of crap. Our and men have been discovered. Liang Shi, to the and surprise the of no one, does not feel like dueling Chi Shong. It's a little disappointing. A little devil. disappointing. But not surprising. Now their cav, the biggest threat is probably the cavalry. So we want to try and Stand ready. Hurry. not get Move. caught like this. Stand ready. But Stand it could be ready, inevitable, you know? Something will inevitably get caught. Ready to ride? Faster. I mean, the fact that they've split their cavalry is coming so far ahead, it's the time has come. very Ready beneficial for us. The enemy unit flees! What cowards! Cavalry. So we'll just pull our cavalry back, keep an eye on things. Horsemen. Spearmen. Send in shoe spearmen where it's Prepare. necessary. Attend. Okay, Chi Shung's going Steal here. Yourself. Stand ready. You will lose and be the forgotten. The bulk of the mainline fighting is about to Do begin. Do not waste your breath. You will need it. So you should probably get these guys Cavalry. through somewhere. Time. The time has come. Not sure where Our though. Noble go, go, is being ready. Pop this. Even though it's not going to hit that group. Bowmen. Cataphracts. Support. Kill you guys stay in guard mode. I need you guys over here. You guys need to stay in guard mode too. Please keep shooting, catapult. We'll pop this. Actually use our abilities. We could get a big morale debuff here too. Can use if in melee. Oh, there we go. I'm going to send out Luji to um, shut down some of these archers if we can. The Chu spearmen over here are champions of the people. They're just holding. Which is part of what makes them so dangerous. Where are the other ones? I need you guys out here. And this isn't the, the best thing for cataphracts to be doing. No match. But Make ready. sometimes you don't really get much of a choice. March. March like Lu Ji. <laughs> he has work to do. Take heat, now with Ji Shung, I want to get him over here and shut down these strategists. Get rid of just all of go, their go, go. support. Unfortunately, the front line over here kind of buckled. So let's get the cataphracts involved. Come on, surely you can do better. Should probably get the shoe, the if other shoe spearmen over here. If we can. They are a little slow. 
It is, of course, the weakness. The enemy warriors are running. Fire upon them. See if we can shoot into this mess. To attention. The time has come. Double time. We need to get these guys unstuck too. This is a bit of a problem. People are just being caught up on things. Okay, choose spear and turn around. Where is Fai? Hey, you're supposed to be killing these these ladies. I know you can do it. What are you fighting? Archers? That's okay. Oh, how witty! How very witty! The enemy warriors are Isn't that witty? Make ready! Unleash fury! Steal yourselves! Make but ready. we are winning. Which I think we're about to win right now. Ready. Good timing on my behalf. <laughs> Take heed, warriors. Stand ready. We only got to use our abilities once because of the strategists. No it's a little depressing. But it is what it is, you know? Where are the other kind of right here? Yeah, I guess you can kill that. Again, we just want to clean things up for our actual assault on the Chung on Jade Mine. Because the Jade Mine will make us lots of money. Again. Alright, claiming our victory now. Much cleaning everything up. Well, as much as possible, anyway. <clears throat> Your council has delivered to you their requests. A list hey, look, this of thing assignments again. they strongly recommend you pursue. <gasps> Your generals Ooh, are crucial to I'm your shouting. Success. Well done, Luigi. Throw him down. Like the coward A he is. A quick wit dodges the hardest blow. Let's just see. We should probably take the replenishment. I want the money, but... We have need of good fighters. We're taking the replenishment so that we can just immediately sell to the Jade Mine and call it a day. Sima Lun joined a war alongside Sima Yue against Sima Zhao. Sima Ong declared war on Zhu Ruo. Sima Jiang declared war on Sima Ong. Sima Mo signed peace with Sima Ong. Mao Ren requested their master Sima Ai to go to war with Shan Yu. And Sima Pu has come of age. Spend or save? Some time ago, you gave the Empress your word that she would sequester funds for the war effort. She comes to you now, demanding that money be delivered in full. How do you answer her demand? We have reached the next rank of wealth alignment. So, we could give her what was asked. Begin working on spirit, of which we have zero. We are losing in mind alignment, unfortunately. But there's no option here. We'll give her what was asked. Your word is your honor. You send the requested amount in full. That's fair. Fai Yi, we can now give him this armor. I don't really have anyone for you there. Zeal, yes, please. Thank you. I, I love me some I zeal. Don't. And here is the Chongon Jade Mind returned. Cunning triumphs over brute force. To its proper owner. We have captured T Zhuo. Well, since I like your traits, we're gonna release We you. are not barbarians. Remain flexible. And you aren't Yet exactly agency. like Sima Wei. You haven't executed any of my people. I shall give you the respect that I think you deserve. So we probably just want Xiong Marauders. I think we should finish upgrading our front line first. Seems like a good idea. Also less expensive. Should we put in hunters in this army? They're gonna have so much ammunition. I'm actually kind of curious how much ammo they would have. You know what? Let's do it. We'll put in one. So let's get two real archers and then one of the hunters. That will also serve as some more cavalry. Can't go wrong with cavalry. I mean, you can, but I try not to. <laughs> Jin Zi was slain in battle. Sima Pu, this is our heir. Ooh, he's rank four. So what do we want Sima Pu to do? He is a vanguard, which means he's probably terrible at administration sort of things. Guile. He has zeal. I'm proud of you, my son. Intensity. 
He's looking like a combatant. Does not suffer morale penalty when the general dies. Can also rally after routing more often. Hmm. We're going this way. Dam melee damage for all shock cap. I like it. Um, do we want final rush? Enabled if battle outcome decided. Hmm. Scare is pretty cool. Can be very useful for breaking people. I want to head towards dignity though. So we probably pick up clarity and then dignity. Because the faction support will apply to us. Then we can head up here. Alright. See my poo, my boy. Let me take a look at our family tree, actually. We haven't done that in a little bit. So family tree, Sumai and Zhong Lijiu, happily married together. Sima Pu is our faction heir. And these are all of our children. I think we began with Sima Pu and Sima Kuo. Yeah. The rest of these are because of Zhong Lijiu, who's actually not horribly satisfied at the moment. Desires higher court position. Yeah, we haven't given her any yet. Soon, my dear, soon. What can we put here, Baishin? Well, nothing, because we don't have any money. That's fair. That is fair. We can reach Chang'an in one turn, so I don't feel inclined to move out at all. No one has a trade agreement available to them. It feels bad. And Faction Council. Court Nobles awaiting assignment. We can invoke in two turns. So in two turns, we do. Seems good. Next turn. Next turn. I like these early turns that are so easy. <laughs> Gets a bit chaotic when you have six and seven armies going around. What is this? Warriors reinforced leather for a war axe. I would like to see what this is. Oh. No. I'm actually willing to give away the war axe, but I don't want this. I want money. Yeah. Let's talk money, Jin Empire. I can give you some other ancillaries as well. We can throw in another axe. The axe, you a question? Actually, I kind of want to keep that. How's a, how about a fish and a feather? Fan. Made of feathers. Is there anything else I can give you? No, not really. Wait, could I trade you Ba? I don't really want it. No. I didn't think so, but okay. So because this isn't making you any happier with me, I'm just going to take everything. Bleed you dry, you know? One, 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 one. Easy. Thank you. I needed that money. And we need to continue befriending the Jin Empire. Even though, of course, that did nothing for our diplomatic relations, as I stated. Sima Mo declared war on Sima Zhao. Poor guy. Research complete. Work, work. Work complete. That's the one I was going for. Um, decentralized military. Guess we're going for that. We only have two options available, so we need to hurry up and rank up. We're not horribly close. Mm, feels bad. Nope. This is mine. Strike quickly. This is mine. You can't take it. Careful planning ensured victory. It's more than careful planning. Let but us yes. make use of it. Chung on is ours. We control the entire commandery. Why are you increasing food production? This isn't how this works. We'll just have that there. Get rid of this crap. Do I just speed this up? No. I want to. Don't get me wrong. How else am I spending my money this turn? Probably upgrading people. This army needs some upgrades. When drawing a bow, Forget it. We're doing it. <laughs> Oof. Heavy. So. Here's what we want. The Jade Mine gives commerce and industry. How do we exploit that? 
by this. So you probably won't be able to build a market thing here due to the fact that we have the private workshops decreasing noble support. So you probably want that and probably a temple, not the judiciary. Temple would be amazing here. What else gives noble support? The inn? Yeah, okay, so we'll take an inn, a private workshop, and maybe a temple. Seems like a good idea. Ooh, that's only 450. Still all of my money. <laughs> it's fine. So with Luji, we continue north. How do I get to Anding? This territory is a little treacherous to cross. From what I remember. And we need to be in our own territory. Simayue has that. It's a little unfortunate. But we will go here. Actually, do we have any other enemies? Sima Liang, could you please stay in your own territory? I would really appreciate it. So we actually don't have any other enemies. It's just Sima Wei and Fan Zhou. Fan Zhou, if I remember correctly, is very far south. So it's probably not worth considering it yet. Reduced to one little area, too. Yeah, just that. And... Sima Wei is north a bit. A fair bit. I think he just has this one territory. Sima Yue. Oh my goodness. Oh, you are bigger than me. I thought he was smaller, but no. You own a lot of very inconvenient territory. I hope you know that. Brother. Hmm. Well, we'll head north with Luji. Actually, I wanted to see if anyone had traded a deal. Nope. All right. We'll continue heading north. We'll stop here for our own replenishment. Consider and act. And continue. I can't really build anything here. All right, those things are noble support. That's fair. Let us see. What are you trying to do, Simaleong? He's trying to get ahead of me. See my loons turned around. Good. No. They want me to pay for the privilege of becoming his vassal. No. That's not how that works. It's the other way around. Sima Chong. Uh, okay, I guess we're accepting this. It's going to make Jiang Zhengli very happy. I don't really care about her happiness. But even if I rejected it, the others would have... peaced out with her. Sima Yue requested Sima Mo to join their war against Sima Yue. Sima Yue requested Jiang Zhengli to join their war against Sima Yue. Wait a minute. Sima Zhang vassalized Song Wei. So, peace. Jin Empire signed peace with Song Wei. The alliance of Sima Chong signed peace with Jiang Zhengli. Bian Ping Zhu formed a coalition with Gu Jin. Hey, big spender. Your court is known as a haven of entertainment and frivolous distraction. Your princes and courtiers are in a state of constant delight, yet the people want for the succor of their lord's generosity. What is dissatisfaction? We can actually eat that. Do we continue with the wealth alignment? This would be a good start for spirit. And I feel like that's what Samayin would actually do. You know? He is the beloved governor, after all. So we'll do that. Invest at home. What surplus you have should be spent on the people. And you invest to that end. Get started on the spirit crap. Luji. So we've now reached a bit of a Crux. I cannot. Won you? Who are you at war with? Gujin. And we are at an alliance war with nobody. Because Jiang Zhengli is now the vassal of somebody. Who was it again?
I like how Sima Long <laughs> just nabbed Yuan Shengjin from Sima Wei. Wait. I'm confused. Oh, is this because... Actually, I don't know why this is. We are respected. I have a lot of questions, Zhang Zhengli. I didn't peace out with her, did I? I'm not that... crazy. The Alliance of Sima Chong signed peace with Zhang Zhengli. So upset a few people. I don't know what just happened, but um, wait, did she join our coalition? No. Yeah, I don't know. Maybe she did. I'm just completely confused on what happened, but that's okay. Let's go. More war. There can never be peace. Humufu? I haven't heard that name before. Hmm. We went to war with one another. Shocker. Yeah, I don't know. I'm lost. Maybe someone can explain to me, but... Who knows? We didn't get any treachery for that. We're still respected. That is not the crank button. See? We're still respected. I thought she became vassalized, but she didn't. So I don't know. She's allied with Sima Yue, Sao Huan, and Sima Mo. So we could go to war with any of them, but it wouldn't necessarily be my fault. I don't think. <laughs> anyway, let's continue building here. Ignore that crap. Could grab a temple. We'll build a temple. Just increase the money. Be humble, but resolute. Just keep increasing the money. All of the money. Now what are we doing with Samaying? We could take a look. We could take a look at assaulting the Jin Empire and nabbing the prince. The prince. The emperor. We're the prince. We could do that. But I don't think we're going to. That just seems like a risky move. You know? We're currently benefiting off of them being here and being rich. Which means we should look at Sima Wei. It's looking like he might be our next big enemy. Mostly because he keeps trying to come into my territory. We'll break this. So we're going to break our military access and consider going to war with him. Invoke my council. Overpopulation. Increase settlement administration building. We aren't doing that anywhere. But Samaying will continue standing vigilant. Huangjin. Wait, can I invite the J the J the Jin Empire into our alliance? Close. We're getting there. We are getting there. So we pieced out with this, I think, because of the alliance. It was an alliance war, and the alliance was like, yeah, we'll peace out. But, you know, now it's a personal war. <laughs> so no one can decide for me if we're going to war or not. And I think we're preparing to go to war with Sima Yue. We're preparing for the possibility of it. I'll leave it at that. You would like military access. I would love to destroy you, actually. But we do have peace. Peace enforced by Sima Leong, of all things. I 
I don't really see a negative in taking this. Can you give me money per turn? Uh, no. All right, that's fine. How much was it? Six thirty something. Wow, this is very finicky. Six forty. Sure, whatever. Wisdom met by wisdom. I wouldn't exactly call it wisdom, kind of just I can't get rid of you as much as I would love to. Sima Jion commanded the vassal Song Wei to join the war against Sima Wei. Looks like everyone's piling on Sima Wei. Sima Ying and Bai Jin are now friends. And Jiang Zhengli and Sima Ying have lost their diplomatic rivalry. Contemplate all. Oddly enough. They lacked a coherent strategy. I've never actually taken Onding before. Actually, this all of this settlement. Our needs. A terrible collapse. Shi Shong is, of course, a noble individual, so we shall oh, pay wow. for the doctors. All right. Ugh. The Jin Empire has the livestock. Of course they do. Of course they do. Why wouldn't they? This would actually be an amazing settlement for this. Hmm. Alright, so we'll upgrade that. Our strategists have returned. So, how do we want them here? Oh, yeah. Oh, it's beautiful. So, Zhong Lizhu, our beloved wife, who is no longer busy, stimulate the markets. And over here in Wudu, we should do the same thing. Who are you? Shi Ji. I don't know, but Lu Ji, please elevate this. Make me very happy. We'll build an inn. Build an inn, instant construct it, and upgrade the city. Easy. Voodoo is a little damaged, but we do have Shen Yuan here guarding it. Shen Yuan. Yuan. Bashi. We don't have entrepreneurs. No, it unlocks the resource entrepreneurs. We need to upgrade the city. That's what it is. Well, okay. We're just missing money for that. So I guess we'll continue to upgrade food production. And peasantry income. I do love me some peasantry income. Requires the tea house, though. We don't have a tea house. Where even is the closest tea house? It'd probably be over here somewhere, right? Like down here? Hmm. Should we consider going south? I don't know. No, we just continue to position ourselves cautiously. Be wary of Sima Yue. Right now I'm a little wary of Sima Leong. No. Although I am interested in 1500 gold a turn. No. <laughs> the Jin Empire, not moving. They are very passive. I mean, the Han Empire is as well. The Empress demand retributions. One of your more error-prone retainers has unintentionally offended the Empress. She now demands a formal groveling apology. Yet your comrade insists they did nothing wrong to warrant such a thing. You could apologize in their place or reject her demands. My wife? <clears throat> Empress? This is my wife. Unfortunately, I would love to refuse. This would make me very happy, but I'm not going to. <sighs> Compensator. The Empress can surely be appeased in other ways. I'm pretty sure every time we get that dilemma, I've always appeased her. <gasps> Sima Fu. Why is his name familiar? Sima Fu. Hello. This seems like a spy. Oh, he's disloyal. So maybe he's not a spy. Maybe he's just legitimately disloyal. He has double... Double traits that increase his ambition. To gain independence. Yeah, no thank you. No thank you. I don't care if you're legendary. Zhang Minping. Let me guess, you're from Zhang Zhangli? No, okay. Ji Khan. Nice name. 
Not interested in recruiting anyone at the moment, though. I'm not sure where you even came from, Shizi. Looks like we generated him somehow. Okay. That's fine. Hanjong. Do you want to increase the city? The silk. The silk. Silk comes first. Alright, we have taken the city and we can reach the toolmaker. Oh, that's not good. That's not good at all. We outwitted them. Uh-oh. This location suits our plans. Uh-oh, spaghetti. -o. Hey, we found him. Uh-oh. There is cunning in caution. Well. Smiling, I require your assistance. Oh boy. Remain Let's go. Dormant. On the march. I need you. I need your help. I think if we get attacked here, we just offer surrender. I think that's what we're going to have to do. The Grand Guest House. Grand Tea House. Now let's go Grand Guest House. This is all peasantry, right? Yeah. Composite Woodmaker. Well, here's crossing our fingers that Luigi doesn't get absolutely wrecked. Are your fingers crossed? Mine are crossed. Trade? No, all right. Crossing, oops, crossing fingers. He would like peace. We could be a real douchebag and take this and then betray him, but we aren't that way. Maybe if we were playing a Simalun. Oh, oh? I'm confused. What just happened? Why did he lose, like, a retinue? I am confused. Pleased, of course, but confused. Faction developments, overpopulation complete. The last research we can do until we become Grand Prince. We are... Brain? 66 points away. Okay. No. So he... What even just... Did his general die? The one that was wounded? Because he can't recall in foreign territory, right? There is cunning in caution. I'm confused. I also can be hilarious if he takes this fight. He shouldn't. But he might. Yeah, okay. Always That's what I thought. Strike now. That's what I thought, bro. Close victory. So for our final... This will be our final battle for today's episode. A nice climactic ending. Destroying. Sima Fan. Once and for all. <laughs> okay. I like this field. I know it's supposed to represent that An Ding is kind of like a barren wasteland sort of thing, but I like open. I like fighting in barren wastelands. I have never used this formation. The four catapults in a row. Is it any good? You know what? Screw it. Let's try it. We're gonna win, so he says. Did I just jinx it? <laughs> I don't think so. We should be fine. Although we are the ones attacking, so I may need to move up a little bit. We'll see. I'm just in this formation because it's comfortable. Fire arrows. You guys here. Show marauders. Um... 
We'll keep you on standard fire. For armor piercing. Aigi, Chishung, Lushi. Cataphracts. And crappy horses. Ready. They are coming to me. Alright, thanks. Appreciate that. I really do. Shoot into the blob. Blob shoot them. I mean, it seems to be... Is this more accurate? It's like less Our range of fire. This is a terrible idea. I will defeat you. <laughs> Why are you I'm doing this? Ready. I guess it's because Chi Shung is low HP. But isn't she? Yeah, she's level one with no gear. This seems like a horrible idea. Why would you Let's even stand. consider this? I need you guys over here. I shall revel in your destruction. Shut up and die! I'm just gonna pop this ability to make sure everything is fine. Alright, Shishum. Make me proud. She doesn't have tenacity of steel. This is much closer. Than I want it to be. Ideally hope your blade is sharper yeah, than go. your wit. Good kill. The enemy general falls. Ha! Um, now you're a little low on health though. Get on your horsey. Ready! Please get on your horse so I can pull you away. Um, okay, hold on. Bowman. Please support him. He's fleeing. He's getting on his horse. That's fine. Let's see this went well. Um, okay, hold on. Enough being distracted. Go, go, go. Could you guys pull away from that? Use our cataphracts here. Just battle with where this. you are. Amazing that you can both talk and battle. Come down here a little bit. Shi Shang is back. Our noble brother is being attacked. We need to keep a close eye on Foggy's health. Because that's scary. We're actually just going to move Chi Shung out, I think. Like, move him to a safe area. You know? Because uh, this is alarming. We'll pull Fai Yi out now. Everyone's going to kind of collapse here. Chi Shung, stay out of the way. They are continuing to shoot. I like the trails of fire. Helps me see where things are going. Are you unbreakable? That would be a little annoying. You are. And it is a little annoying. Uh, no, you're not going in. We sending Luji in for the kill. He's a little wounded, maybe we don't. We can just send the cataphracts in. Where are they? Oh, you're chasing. You guys aren't, though. We can go ahead and fast forward here. Easy. Appears that is all they could stomach. A decisive victory. Feels good. The AI thought it was close, but it was not. That felt pretty clean. Oof, right into the neck. We outwitted them. Now, they were a retreating army, so they should fall over and die. We captured Sima Fun. And of course, he's a rival with Samai, a nemesis. All right, goodbye. An unfortunate consequence of war. Uh, we'll take their punishment, I guess. We have need of good fighters. Moving out. Can I move into friendly territory? <gasps> Ah, I did it. <laughs> now, it's a little annoying this army is still roaming around, but we can deal with that. All right. That went exceptionally well. A white thoroughbred. Let's take a look at this forest crane. Is earned. We currently don't have any champions on the field, though. So this is also not part of a set. Huh. Range blocks chance. Not... 
the most important thing for generals because they're harder to hit anyway, being a single entity unit. But, uh, you know, whatever. Golden armor is golden armor. We might even just use it to, um, you know, in diplomatic situations for more money. <laughs> Give me that money. We'll continue building that so that noble support doesn't fall too, too steeply, too heavily. Words. Words can be difficult. Keep upgrading all the cities. And Ba continues to just sit here. Maybe one day we'll turn on you on Shangzhen, but she is a part of yeah, Similiang. He's like the new Liu Bei, kind of. Just slightly less nice, I guess. But anyway, <laughs> that is it for today's episode. Thank you all for watching. I hope that you enjoyed. Look at that. Prince and advisor together on the field, hand in hand. They will see you next time. Bye-bye.